What's up, everybody? Welcome to Podcast Now Plus. I'm Alex, and in this video, I want to talk about the multiverses trophies. They have leaked, so I guess if you don't want to know what the trophies are for this game, I mean, none of them are spoiler. I mean, it's how you get the platinum for the game, uh, but they are out there. I want to kind of go over some of the highlights and talk about uh, my impressions of them, and so we'll kind of just jump in. So it does have a platinum, obviously, or thankfully, I guess you could say, and it really, it doesn't actually have that many trophies, and games like this generally are, uh, are kind of divided in terms of how you win and how many times you win and that's pretty much what you get in this game as well there's things of giving out five toasts to other players then there's 10 there, then there's 100 there's accepting 100 matches there's things for uh getting ring outs 100 ring outs 50 ring outs there's uh things of how to win how many times you need to win uh the max there is winning 300 match made games 100 double ring outs is the max for that one 100 ring outs using your spike getting 200 ring outs with a projectile and then playing matches with a party there's 25 there's 100 and there's 500 honestly like th th this seems to be a list of trophies there's 29 i believe in all it's a list of trophies that honestly doesn't seem all that unreachable it's, it's pretty specific but i feel like it's just and, and i guess the only difficult thing probably in this list is that you have to play at probably a mind-bogglingly high amount, right? Not just being able to win, I think, 300 and then playing 500 in a party. That alone, right? That's a lot of matches. Now, in those matches, you may very well be able to do everything else. If you don't, again, there's, I, I think, honestly, there's a kind of a limited amounts of things and everything is paired. So if you do uh, 10 double ring outs, then you just have to do 25. Then you have to get 100. But it's the same thing. You just have to do it multiple times. So I feel like doing stuff in a party Party with a group of friends um, would probably be the best way of earning a platinum if you guys are interested in that who knows it how I approach platinums nowadays is there are some games that I kind of have my eye on from the beginning that I will like go for right just off the jump then there's other games and this is the majority of how I do it there's games where if I so happen to get a lot of the trophies naturally as I'm playing and I get close I will go all the way. This honestly is kind of one of those games. Like if I could see myself getting half or more than half just by playing and having fun, jumping in, playing a couple matches every night, if I see I'm getting there, I could see this being a game that I, you know, you know what I mean, you just go all the way in and you get the platinum for or you get all the achievements on Xbox, right? So let me know what you guys think. Make sure you guys are subscribed, bell icon turned on, and I hope to see you all on tomorrow's video.